No, no, keep the camera over there. I want everyone to see it. This is why we're third. And here comes our first float of the day, Tom. It's the James Woods High football team with their not gay review. We just want the big game. F Phil, Phil, just open it. Unlock the doors. You don't have to put the key in the ignition. Well, open the driver's side first. Okay, well, I guess it's broken then, and there's nothing we can do about it. Okay, happy Thanksgiving, Quahog. Here's a car alarm. Look who's here! Happy Thanksgiving. Gobble, gobble. You guys, thanks so much for having us over. Well, we're just glad we can have people over again now that that giant crab's gone. Hey, guys, how you doing? Come on in. No, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Oh. Me! Peter, come look at this. He sees a baby and knows that he's also a baby. So smart. Mama's smart little boy. Uh, check out Quagmire. It's been a year and a half, and he still looks uncomfortable around his dad. Well, it's a big adjustment. Happy Thanksgiving. I brought marshmallow peeps. Oh, okay. I'm gonna need that Pyrex dish back. Okay. I'm gonna need it back now. Oh. I don't want anything else today. But it's 2.30. Time for dinner. Because on Thanksgiving, 2.30 is dinner time for some reason. <laughs> Oh, my, Lois, those sweet potatoes look delicious. That's the stuffing, Ma. Now put on your glasses. Ah, okay. Wow. Hey, is there room at that table for one more? <gasps> oh, my God! Kevin Swanson! Son, you're alive! Oh, and I stayed up all night. Kevin, you're alive! I don't believe it! Oh, my God, it's a miracle! Well, I guess you replaced real butter as the star of the dinner. But I don't understand. The army said you'd been killed in action. What happened? Well, it's made. Ah, uh, you're all wet, Swanson. I call the white meat. I call the dark meat. I call the cell phone duct tape to the side. No! They're all dead, sir. Except for Swanson. He's in a coma, but he's unlikely. It says I support the troops. Because there's nothing I wouldn't do for you guys. But I don't have any change on me right now. Well, all that matters is that my boy is home. Kevin, I want you to meet your little sister, Susie. Wow. Hey, little sis. Look, guys, I'm not a hero, and I don't want to be treated any different than before. Just that you would say that means we should treat you different. Come on, guys, let's give them all our best food. Okay, now you eat up, and then we're all going to go out back and play some Thanksgiving touch foot. That's a great story, Grandpa. I didn't like it. None of my grandchildren had ever disliked one of my stories before. From then on, he was my favorite. Well, I don't like that story, great-grandpa. Ah! I work hard to put a cornucopia on this table, and you're out showing your lower ankle to every Tom, Tom, and other Tom in our village. Don't talk to mother in like fashion! That's it! The belt is coming off! Around me, and I'm mad and scared! <laughs> Lois, this pumpkin pie looks delightful. Hey, Kevin, can I see your purple heart? Because I never actually seen one. one. One time, this homeless guy showed me his purple head. ...and kill one of my bunkmates and cripple the other one for life. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Now, I thought earlier you said that both of your bunkmates were killed. Now you're saying only one of them was? But I just want you guys to know I barely even stared at that penis for an hour. <laughs> no. This whole time? You weren't really injured in Iraq? First Pat Tillman lies about how he died, and now you? Kevin, I don't understand. There's nothing to understand. Our son is a deserter. Come on, Kevin, I'm taking you to jail. Joe, wait. Not now, Bonnie. Joe, you can't. A story? Like the one about when he found out his mother is really his grandmother? Could you be more specific? Uh, oh, let's see. Uh, he always wears cheap cologne. Uh, drives a Mercury Cougar with a crown on the dashboard. Uh, never pays his alimony. Uh, he's extreme. <laughs> That store's having a fire sale! <laughs> I tell you, that kid was strong-headed for his age. Smart, but innocent. And then one day, there was a firefight. <laughs> I had to get out of Iraq. I just had to wait for my chance. I call the white meat. I call the dark meat. I call the cell phone duct tape to the side. No! Somehow, I've been spared that Thanksgiving. You want to hear some? No. Are you sure? They're pretty intense. No. no! Here, let me just read one. If I can guess a line in there, will you not read it? I don't think you'll be able to guess a line. Is it something like, ice burns as hot as fire? Okay, so then I went to Europe. Or... There's just one thing I want you to do. What's, What's that? that? Talk me out of it. No, 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 no. What the hell is going on up there?
Well, I'm sorry you all feel the way you do, but I walked away from an illegal war of aggression being fought six... They followed orders. You're saying our troops are like the Nazis? No, I'm just saying that blindly following orders has resulted in the deaths of millions of people throughout history. You know, I have not talked to Carol all night. Carol, how are you? Look, I, I think you guys are all rushing to Egg Queen. Son, when you go to war, you don't end up fighting for your country or your family or your flag. You're fighting for your fellow soldiers there in the foxhole with you. You walked out on those men, and that's what's most unforgivable. You know what, everyone? What are you talking about? You don't remember, do you? I was in first grade. You took me out with you on one of your shifts. I just think it's presumptuous. I mean, come on, the country's best yogurt. You know, prove it. Show me your data. Help! Police! Do. I have three very wide-eyed children to feed. Hey, Guido, watch this. <laughs> Whoa, I've got to lay off the coffee. Ha cha 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 That's Jack, sex Oh, Mary, you'll never leave us, will you? Yes, those are lovely, but it doesn't quite answer our question. The lizard. Public urination is just wrong, except during the Million Man March when protesters burned out porta potties. Then I used. So smart, my head would explode if I even began to know what I was talking about. Ah! Oh my god, stop ah! crying! Ah! Ah! Oh! Holy crap! Oh my god. People, I think he's really upset. Gather around, everybody. Ten bucks is all it takes. Step right up and fight my wife. <gasps> oh, no. Ah, oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, uh, help me. Help me. For God's sake, she's going to kill me. No. Star pupil, I want you in my advanced class. Advanced class? No, 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 no. I I'm trying to quit. Well, fine, quit. But get used to people walking all over you. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Cry home to your mama. She waiting for you. Now, don't make me put my size 13s up your narrow ass. I don't sweat you. Bring it on, bitch. Now, how are you going to act? Sheesh. Bringing that trash in here. Days are over. Lois Griffin demands respect. <laughs> Ooh, I smell a messy diaper. God, why does that turn me on? Starting now, you two are going to love each other. Now, stay that way. It's going to be weird to party. She's flowers. Look at the garbage, those damn leafers. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's in a window this time. Wow, look at them run. Wait a second, Brian. That gives me an idea. What the hell are you doing? Excuse me, is your refrigerator running? Because if it is, it probably runs like you. Very homosexually. What? Uh, how, you wanna dance? Go back where you came from, you bastards. We'll conclude today's graduation ceremony with a demonstration. Broken. And spin the wheel, raggedy man! Go, Lois! Pummel him with your powerful fists of female fury! And then when he's weary, emasculate him with your incessant nagging. <laughs> Women. Congrat- This is mine! This is where my babies come from! And now back to the movie of the week, Speed 3. Gl See, you know, maybe tomorrow or- uh... Take him off. Yeah, okay, okay honey. Whoa! What the hell are you doing? Those are my graham crackers! <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> oh no! Peter! Stewie, what did you do? It looks like he freed the beast all over the back. Now, a word from our sponsors. It takes a very steady hand. Don't touch the sides! <clears throat> Butterfingers! I, I was making radio shows for fun. Excuse me. Really? And I suppose you think I enjoy hanging on to those hammocky deposits of gin sugars you call buttocks? What was that? What did you just write there? Uh, give me that. Insecurance was that time bomb I left ticking in your uterus before I came out. Happy 50th birthday, Lois. It's obvious that your son is learning this behavior from someone. I, uh, I, I know who's responsible. Manage what? I know I went a little overboard with my taijutsu, but from now on, we're not gonna have any more anger in this house, okay? Well, then tell Chris to quit drawing pic- 
I'm Lois. I break for yard sales, but I don't let Peter buy anything he likes, like that Narragansett beer shine where the hot chick has two mugs for jugs. It was eight freaking dollars, and we have a dozen... Whoa, whoa, Peter, calm down. I'm sick of Lois's... You got something to say to me? Yeah, P.S. <laughs> oh, oh, hold on a sec. <laughs> oh, hold on, hold on, relax. Everybody relax. Oh, that was fun. What country... Sh you happy now? Don't you use that tone of voice, you... you... Well, what were you gonna... What were you gonna say? Fetish? Wide load? Yo, boy? Uh, the country that you owe so Roy Clark? How about all of the above? Oh, is this for a kicking, Lois? <laughs> Hurts, doesn't it? You tell me. Ah, 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 Man, I'm glad we got that out of